And then a fourth area has to do with this idea of simplicity, of elegant simplicity. Listen to some of these words of his. Any fool can make things bigger, more complex, and more violent. It takes a touch of genius and a lot of courage to move in the opposite direction. Mm -hmm. To simplify. How many of you find yourself really savoring the idea of simplification or simplicity in your life? Raise your hand. That's a lot of us, the majority of us in this room. And yet, what do we tend to do? We tend to do just the opposite. We tend to, to fill our lives with so much stuff, both literally and figuratively, and then wonder why we feel so burdened and stressed and challenged. To look for the more simple ways to do and to be. And that requires that we really pay attention to the things that really matter. Einstein talked about this idea that not everything that matters can be counted and not everything that can be counted matters. When we get that, we begin to probe more deeply into the idea of how, how to live life with simple elegance. Simple elegance. He says, look deep into nature and then you will understand everything better. There is a simplicity inherent in nature. There's an economy of motion in nature. He says, when the solution is simple, God is answering. God always takes the simplest way. How many of you have ever made a mountain out of a molehill? Don't, you don't have to raise your hand. <laughs> How many of you can ever take a problem that's this big and you analyze it to the nth degree and suddenly it's this big? That is the opposite of what Einstein is inviting us to do. Any fool can make things bigger, more complex, more violent. It takes a touch of genius and a lot of courage to move in the opposite direction. I find myself often asking, is there a simpler way to approach this situation, this problem, this person, this opportunity? Is there a simpler way for me to go about this task that I have? Maybe a simpler way is to get clear on whether it even needs to be done or not. There's a big one, right? Is there a simpler way? I think there's an elegance to simplicity. And I think sometimes our human nature is to make things way more complicated than they need to be. So my invitation to you is to sit with the idea, how can I simplify my approach to things? How can I simplify my life? Is there an elegantly simple solution to the situation I find myself in right now?